Welcome back guys to Christine's Jamaican Kitchen. So today I am doing crawfish soup. Before we get started, if you haven't already, hit that like and subscribe button. Tap that notification bell to be notified as soon as there's more recipes available. This is all my ingredients that I need for this dish. Grace cock soap, salt, pimento, pumpkin, Irish potato, carrots, okra, optional, spicy pepper, thyme, scallion, garlic, corn, yam, flour, and my crawfish. My pot is on the stove with four liters of water. Before it start boiling, I wanna go ahead and just cut up my carrot and my pumpkin. So, you wanna cut the head off the carrot and the tail part right here. Then you wanna just go ahead and just kinda scrape your carrot. Just like this. Your pumpkin. So I left a little piece so you guys could see. So usually you, of course, you clean the middle out. So if anything is in the middle, you cut it out. Usually the skin is so hard you cut the skin off just like this I'm gonna go wash them and I'll be right back So you wanna do your pumpkin. I do chunky slices. I don't do it too small. These are my rest of my pumpkin right in here. My carrot, I do thinner slices. After slicing them thin, then I go in and then just kind of slice them in half. This is all my carrots all chopped and ready. I'm just gonna add one peg of garlic. I just slice it in half. Like so, just gonna add it right in here with my pumpkin. I am ready to put my pumpkin with my one peg of garlic and some of my carrots in my boiling pot. Come on over. Crawfish has been washed with lemon 
and now I'm ready to add it to my pot. My pot has been boiling for 30 minutes, so now I'm ready to add my spinners. So you see, I have my dough already made right here. My corns, so you see I strip it down and I cut them really small. My potatoes. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and show you how I peel my yam. So you need to get this part off. This is where it was cut already. And you know how it, you see how it is. So we just need to cut this off so it looks just like this part, freshly cut. So just thin, really thinly get it off. Just like so. Then you're just gonna cut the skin. Those who are not familiar with the yam, it scratches. So you gotta be really careful. Just gonna set it in this container so I could wash it and then just slice it. My pumpkin is all boiled out. So here's a little piece right here, so I show you. See, so I'm just gonna smush it to the side right here, like so, as we want it to mash out. Just like that. So it gives the pot a yellowish color. At this point, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna add my spinners. Remember I showed you how to make your little spinners when I did my stew peas video? Little dumplings.
things. Potatoes. After 15 minutes, I am ready to add the rest of my seasoning. My thyme, my scallion. Let me show you how I did my scallion. So of course you cut it, you know, you clean it up, wash, and I just use the back of the knife and just beat it like this. Just bend it, just like so. That's it. I'm gonna put my okras in, so I'm just, my okras are already washed, so I'm just gonna cut the head off, a little tail right there, I call it the tail. <laughs> so, and then I'm just gonna slice. And this is optional, add my cock soup, and you know your cock soup has salt in it. So if you wanna, if you, you know, add salt to taste, cause the cock soup is already salty. Woo, look at this pot is bubbling. So, scallion and thyme, my peppers. So I do two kinds. You can do the yellow, the green. I actually grow the purple and the yellow, so I'm, you know, using my grown pepper, spicy pepper. The rest of my garlic. My pimentos, right here, pimentos. And a little bit of okra. Look at this guys so you add a whole so your peppers should be whole you don't want to cut them ready for my cup noodle stir Try not to burst your peppers. Ten minutes later, dinner is ready. Look at this, guys. Look at this my crayfish soup speaks for itself look let me go right in and dig in oh my goodness guys creamy just right, delicious. Oh my gosh. And look at my crayfish. Or clawfish, or we call it crayfish. Look at this, guys. I ain't get enough. Bye. Bye for now. Bye. Thanks for watching. For more recipes, click the link over here.